Okay, so this is not actually where I'm gonna keep it, but I thought I would do the first 30 minute warm up um, here while I have it here. So the, it just said to wipe down everything with a damp cloth and then run it for 30 minutes on any temperature. So I guess let's do that. I read the directions, but that doesn't really mean much. Let's go for 1.30. And then here's the timing. Whoops. There we go. So, just let that go. Oh my God, this is trouble. These are like uh, basically raw cookies. So that basically means like they're diet cookies. <laughs> oh my God, I can't wait to do this. Look at these crackers. Oh my God. I don't know what else they have. Let me see. Oh, you know what I want to do? Look at those carrot chips. I get something at Trader Joe's and they're um, jerk plantains. I would love to make something like that, but I'm just barely looking through this book and I'm getting hungry. I can't wait to eat any of this stuff. Okay, so... I have all the chilies. Oops, there goes one on the floor. That's what I get for putting these in first, right? We have jalapenos, habaneros, cayennes, and some boots in here. Um, we're gonna see how long they take. And I'll turn this on so you can see how not loud it is. Okay, so vegetables say 125 degrees on their little booklet, their recipe booklet, and it says six to 12 hours. So let's see what I decide when I start pushing buttons. We want it to, wait. 25 and we want it we're gonna go with seven and a half can you hear that like that's as loud as it gets that's it Okay, so this went off in the middle of the night. <sighs> it's really early right now, 4 a.m. So this thing, it ends, obviously, as you can see, it beeps five times when it's finished and then it shuts off. So I know they're not gonna be done. You can kind of already see in there, but let's take a look-see. what's happened. They're still totally squishy. They need time, more time. These are done. And I figured they would be because they were already drying. The two um, hobby trays are not gonna be done. And I don't think the jalapenos will be done yet. You can see they're squishy still. And I'm sure the boots are not going to be. See, here's some boots. Boots are not done yet either. So I'll take um, 
the tray of cayennes out because I'm sure they're completely done. And um, then I'll put it on more. So remember, we're at seven and a half hours now. And then I'll put it on for more. Well, I'll be back. Okay, so we went the other four and a half hours and this is all we got that's already dry. We got a couple of, um, I don't know, I think this is a boot. A couple of boots, a baby scotch bonnet, some hobbies, and the Cayennes. Um, so I'm going to have to run it for more. I'm going to guess I might have to do double the time, but maybe I'll do it for another seven hours and see what happens. In the book that it comes with, it says do it at 125 um, vegetables and for six to 12 hours. But these are, if you can see, they're literally nowhere near being dry. So, and even the hobbies are, I feel like they're even more squishy. So, um, Maybe I'm gonna turn up just be, just for because I'm gonna turn up the uh, temperature a little, and maybe go for like another seven seven hours. Dang, I, they I think they could almost more than double what they've done. It seems almost easier to leave them out on the counter so far, but um, like literally. But whatever, let's just do it and we'll go from there. Uh, five, six, seven. Let's go with that. And let's go with seven. Because now we're at a full total of 12. So seven more. Um, let's see what happens. Maybe I won't use it for this. Maybe I'll dry the chilies out on the balcony as I usually do or on the counter, but use it for other things. I don't know. First trial run, so we'll see. So it ended again and this would be 19 hours. I know these things aren't dry yet. I mean, they're dry, but they're still like Scooshy. I don't know. I mean, it looks good enough to me, to be honest. So, I don't think I'm going to go and eat. Oh, these really are like... I don't know if I'll go any longer with it. Um, maybe I'll just put them out on the counter. I don't know. I haven't decided. But, oops, these are a little bit more dry. But not really. I feel like 19 hours should be enough. I don't know. I just can't give up yet, so I'm gonna do it again. And I'm gonna turn it up. And I'm gonna go, I'm gonna, I know it's still gonna be a while, so I'm gonna do it for 12 hours. Let's see. Well, I only went for another hour and a half. And um, they're still like soft, but they're dry. So that's gonna be it. So this is how I have it. Uh, the jalapenos are still a little soft, but you know. The, the hobs are more softer, but um, I don't feel like running them anymore. And I feel like I can dry them as much as I want to dry them or not dry them. And in the next, tomorrow and the next day are supposed to be like in the 90s. So I'm going to put them outside in the sun and let them um, dry up a little bit more that way. I don't know. We'll see. The verdict is still out. Um, Maybe I'll make some cookies or some crackers or something else in there and see um, how I feel about this thing.